What's up guys and welcome back to Minecraft PlayStation 4 Edition and today we're going to be continuing home back from our, our journey. I was going to do this off screen, but then, can you see it? Can you see it? How about now? Okay, maybe not. <laughs> but we ran into a village. This, this, this is what we spent the whole episode last time trying to find and now it just pops up. It's sort of the opposite direction from the spawn now, but that's okay. Let me eat up and then we'll try to swim our way over there. I wish I had more logs on me so I could do a little bit more, but we'll be okay. We'll be just fine. And that's cool because I think the sun is actually almost heading its way down. I actually don't know where the sun is. Uh, Mr. Sun? Well, the sun's gone. <laughs> I don't know where it is, actually. I mean, this just isn't a good angle to see. It's probably like behind those trees or something. I don't know. Weird. But I I'm sure it's almost down. If we, and once it's, oh, well. I swear I was closer to the ground than that. Doesn't matter, we're gonna go and check out this village and hopefully we we'll find some cool stuff there and then we'll make a beeline back to our house. I'm actually a little lost right now because it's been like a week or so since I last recorded. So I'm a little turned around, but hopefully we can find a way back. I see a jungle that we definitely haven't been to. So this is a place where I can recoup. I can make a boat here. I can maybe get some more food if I need it. I can check for a jungle temple because it's definitely a jungle we have not been to. And I swear that the game has spawned in more biomes since we last played. I mean, I don't know, it's super weird. I know that if there's an area that you haven't visited physically, it'll spawn in a new biome. But there have been spots that we've definitely been to before that it has replaced with another biome. Which is just weird, it's also a little alarming. It's like, oh gosh, I hope my house doesn't get replaced one of these days. I don't know, it's sort of scary to think about, so I'm not going to. Okay, so I did want to approach a few new things. There is a new update, and apparently this new update has added a few achievements. I haven't had the time to check it. I might check it sometime this episode, because I'm just now remembering it. I didn't remember it when I was getting started this recording because I got so excited about, of course, the uh, <laughs> this village over here. It's a small one. It's a tiny little village, but hey. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, but there might be some great stuff here. Hey, guys, whoa. Okay, you cannot deny that's cool. He sort of has like a little tree, a cobblestone tree. Growing up, this is a really cool village. All right. So we got plenty of wheat. We got plenty of stuff going on here. All right, hey, buddies. Do you guys have anything super cool? You have an enchanted book pro projectile protection. Interesting. I don't have any emeralds on me, so if you guys need emeralds, I, I can't really deliver. Another respiration one. Hi, chicken. <laughs> hmm, let's go over here, and then I don't think there's anybody in here. I hear somebody walking around. Uh, hello, you guys have a very barren place here. You got some leather pants, that's pretty cool. I, oh, I actually have enough to give you one emerald. Sure, I'll take that exchange. <laughs> All right, hey, hey, where are you going? Where, yeah, where do you think you're running through? I, I'm gonna talk to you. Oh, your depth, wait, depth, what? Depth strider. I'm guessing that's like an un underwater thing? Look at this, though. What if there's a chance of finding another village out here? I don't know, the savannah biomes are just so much fun. Hello, you're who I just talked to, right? Then yeah, then who is that guy over there? I'm not sure. There's a lot of villagers here for being such a small little village. It's like very compact. That's Infinity One, which I'm not entirely sure what Infinity One does. Don't fall in that well. You better be careful. Little Johnny fell in the well again. Ooh, an Iron X. Not bad, not bad. All right, that's pretty cool. None of you guys really have too much for me, but I was just glad to run into a village. And this will give me a nice safe place to recoup. If I need somewhere to stay for the night, I can choose here. I still want to find something a little cooler than this when it comes to villages, but hey, I'm just glad we found one way out here. Just what I've been in the mood to find and I found one, so cool. All right, getting some of that so I can make myself a boat. I have my crafting table ready as well. So yeah, we got lots of stuff here. Let me go ahead and place that. And then, uh, hmm. All right, yeah, we need to make just as much as these as we can. We got a lot of redwood. That's what this is called, Arcacia, Acacia. Not Arcacia, but Acacia. Hmm, now we just need to find that. Okay, so let's make, let's make a few boats, just two of them. That way, and I'll place this down. Help out the environment a little bit here. And that one. <laughs> I just don't want them in my hand. There. <laughs> All right. Hmm. What can we do about this? So, so we got the boat here. Then all we need to do is break this, just like that. And we're good. All we need to do is get that. Hooray! And we'll bring one of those, maybe we'll bring one of the trees with us. Is that a thing? Okay, so if I bring an acacia sapling to a non-savannah biome, can it still grow properly? You know, I've never thought about that. I'm not really sure, so. Oh, hey, look at the little buddies. Hi, guys. No, don't run into the cactus, please. That makes me sad. Don't hurt yourself. All right, so maybe we'll get some food, too. I mean, I already have some food. I just really need to cook it. 
So, okay, I'll do that too. It's still, ha we still have some daylight. Oh man, I feel sort of bad, you know, I've been doing all this for a village and the village we get wasn't really, it was a little lackluster, so I didn't really get anything from it. Hmm. Let me put this in there. Just cook this stuff up though for a little bit. And then we'll adventure around this jungle as we make our way back, because it's sort of crossing our path anyways. So we'll like cut through that jungle, look for a jungle temple. Can you, no, one, one at a time, please. One at a time. I didn't mean to kill you, but I mean, that's what works, that's what works. All right, so there's one. There's two. <laughs> All right, I'll wait around for this and I'll check the achievements out too. Oh boy, those achievements are not pretty. <laughs> they are not very exciting. Okay, they're exciting but they're scary. You wanna know why they're scary? Cause they're tough. Spawn in a wither, wither, I think you gotta defeat a wither, eat a notch apple, which I don't even know how you get a notch apple. It's like, oh gosh. We have our work cut out for us. This might be a longer series than I was originally expecting now. Like I thought we only had a little bit more to go before we, you know, get to the end and do that. Oh boy, I was wrong, I was wrong. <laughs> Let's go for it though. We're gonna go and we're one day we're gonna finish a series. I know it. Hopefully you guys know it too. But there you go, that's all that kind of stuff cooked up. Let's keep running here and make our way into this jungle. I def definitely wanted to just sort of adventure around this thing, see if I can't find any of those wonderful jungle temples, because I still have yet to find one. You know, I'd really, really like to, just because that's really cool and fun, but, hmm. Yeah, definitely not one over here. Cause this is sort of like an ending little island peninsula. And then we'll get started. Like, I just, I don't remember there being just a wide ocean in the previous episode, but I started right where I ended and ooh, there's a mushroom island. Cool, whoa. What, is that sand in the tree? Okay, this is a bit odd. It's like, oh, that's actually really cool. Imagine I have a little alcove house right here. There's so many cool house ideas on this. It's so awesome. Hmm. All right, I'm gonna climb up here. Get like one last good view, see if I can't find anything. If not, we have to go because we're sort of heading the opposite direction of where we need to. I mean, it's been a fun adventure these last few episodes for sure. And I'm sure I'll be back to adventuring soon. But for right now, I got some work cut out for me back at home now. A lot of achievements we could probably get started on today even. I mean, some of them I, I need to learn what I'm supposed to do. Oh, that's such a cool biome though. There's another jungle off there though. So hopefully if we stay in the dark, or not the dark, in the water. When it becomes dark, we'll stay nice and safe. So this uh, mush, mushroom uh, right here doesn't seem to have too much for me. But if I was to be scared of what could spawn in, then definitely this is a viable option. Because there should be, uh, what's it called? Uh, no monsters, I don't think, spawn on mushroom biomes. Maybe it's mushroom islands, because this looks to be connected to a normal one. Not entirely sure. Huh, it looks familiar though. I think we are getting closer to home now. I don't know, this is all looking suspiciously different though. I'm actually honestly getting nervous now. What if it like spawned over our house? Jeez, I would freak out. <laughs> Maybe a very sad zebra. I don't know though. <laughs> Let's just stay in the water. There's a swamp here, so we should be able to cut through it pretty easily. A bunch of sheep if we wanted to sleep, but that would be too risky if we die. I don't know. Let's just keep going. Keep going indeed. Hey, this is all unfamiliar territory for me. All right, let's keep going. Whoa, whoa, don't hit the lily pads. Oh, I hit the lily pads. That's why I made two. <laughs> All right, so I know now the risks of swimming, or, you know, boating, like that. Hmm, let's go over here. Can I place a boat while I'm in the water? I can. Hey, you get back here, Mr. Boat. Boat? Okay. Oh, geez, there's still lily pads everywhere. I gotta be careful. So I gotta dodge those lily pads. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, why are there so many off this way? Come on now, like, look at how far out we are. Come on, no, no. <laughs> Oh jeez, it's scary. I don't want to be stuck without a boat. Way out here. All right, so we gotta go this way. Oh, I see the well. The well of hope. Guys, it's the well of hope. There, yeah, and I can already see my uh my spawn too. And end, end an enderman. Okay, slow this down. Slow down this boat. Oh, okay, boat, you calm it down. I don't know why you're going off that way, but fine. I'm gonna go fight this creeper, then this enderman. See, yes, we're home. We're just like a hop, skip, and a jump home, so. That's awesome, I don't really care if I die or if I get too, mu too much of a risk. All right, knock you off super far. Come on, oh, gotcha, okay, cool. All right, all right, let's go up here. And then ready for it, ready for it, ready for it. hi -ya! and then hit you one more time, ready? Boom, oh, one more time, one more time. Oh no, I missed, I missed, I missed. There you go, and did you drop? Nothing, you dropped absolutely nothing, buddy. You're breaking my heart. These endermen are so cruel to me, I'll get how far our boat's out. Okay, it might even be faster just not, because we after we get past that little 
you know, spot of water here. Oh jeez, what is that noise? It's a baby zombie. I hate baby zombies. Ready? Hiya! <laughs> one more time, one more time. Ready? Uh, uh, come on. Wait, what are you doing? What are you doing? Fine, you better run. No, you're coming back, huh? You want more? No, you don't. <laughs> Get in that experience. I'm gonna eat up some food. And then we're gonna make our way home. We're going home, we're going home. All right, and jump. <laughs> then let's go ahead. We just need to make our way past this little, you know, plot of water and we're done. We're, we're on our last few runs home. So it looks like it didn't spawn over our world, which is great because that would make me, you know, so scared. Jeez, it's scary to just think about. I got to stop thinking about it. There's a creeper in the water over there. I have to keep away from him. Now a lot of crazy, scary stuff is starting to pop up. Oh boy. I'm forever naming that the Well of Hope though. Now I know. If I see that well, I know everything is pretty swell. <laughs> pretty swell with the well. All right, come on. This is slowly, but surely a squid's in the water too. The most dangerous of water animals. Except the opposite. Oh boy, come on. Almost, almost. All right, yes. Land, sweet land. Oh. And almost home, sweet home. We just gotta get across everything. Basically run away from anything scary. Yep, like a spider that's making scary noises at me. Oh boy, yep, I can already see the light. Oh boy, it's so amazing. Oh, all right, see, excuse me guys, excuse me. Ah! <laughs> he exploded, but not enough. Here, I wanted to change my camera. It won't let me change my camera right now. There it goes, okay, I was gonna do that so I can see who's chasing me, but didn't really work out very well. Here, I gotta run before the skeleton shoots at me. Oh boy, go, 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 go. Go, jeez, it's been so long. I'm finally so glad to be home. I'm never going out without a compass ever again. It was so helpful. I would never have been able to find my way home. All right, and sleep. Well, that was an adventure. Now I want to take some time, you know, kick it back, take a breath, enjoy life a little. You know, just, you know, don't do anything too crazy for a little bit, you know? <laughs> that would be nice, in my opinion. It'd be very nice. Let me throw my iron into here. And we got our second saddle, so if we do ever find a really cool horse, you bet we're gonna use that. Let me put that, yeah, I'll put this in here. There you go. All right, <laughs> I'll do some inventory organizing soon. How are you doing, draft? People told me how to use a name tag. I'll be going and doing that now. So thank you guys you know, so much for letting me know. Hmm. Yep, right, okay, so we have plenty of name tags. What we need to do is we need to go ahead and use it with the anvil. We have a doggy standing on right now. So we do that, and then we, instead of calling it name tag, we could call it giraffe. There you go. And now giraffe, I spelled that right? Okay. And then let's go for it. Okay, now put that on our horse, and he'll be named giraffe. Hooray! How you doing, G-Man? I don't know if that's a good name, a nickname for you or not, but boom. There you go, giraffe. It's 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 a little weird when he's in this, like this, but yeah, if I move him, which we're both a little stuck right now, uh, and then I get off, ow. Let's see, oh, 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 huh, it's weird. It doesn't always show it to me, but it does say it up there. So we, we know it's giraffe. We know you're giraffe, buddy, and that's all that matters. All right, I hope you have fun in here. <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate it, I hear a spider, which is a little scary, but hey. All right, some people have been asking me if I could cover up this. I definitely have been meaning to. So let me get started with that too. We do have a shovel, so, or a spoon. And then if we cover this up, it should just turn into grass eventually. All right, I need to, might need to borrow some more off the side of this mountain, which is fine because I wanted to see if I can't make this mountain, like this little piece right here, like a little alcove at some point, like like build into it, make like a little something here. I'm not sure what I put there, but it'd be cool to have something like that, right? All right, so one of the things I wanted to do, and also these achievements are actually under, um, like, I forget, something pack one, uh, expansion pack one. So I think that it, these don't actually count towards the platinum, but my goal for the series is to do every achievement. So I figure we'll go ahead, and it's like if we stop playing for a year after we get all the achievements, and all of a sudden, hey, there's a new achievement, maybe we'll return to the series every once in a while whenever there's new achievements pop up. But um, let's go ahead and uh, see if we have something very specific, slime balls. Uh, these might be enough here, because we need to make a slime block, and we're gonna be doing something uh, very peculiar. Um, one thing we need to do that is a challenge is bounce 30 blocks high off a slime block. So I'm gonna be trying to do that, and I think I know exactly how to. It's just a matter of uh, 
Finding out how the heck to make a slime block. Uh, hold on. <laughs> well, I'm bummed. We need nine. We have eight. I'll have to get some more soon. Luckily, we know where there's plenty of swamps now, so that'll be eventual. One thing I need to do, though, is get back to using my stock of animals. So I need to uh, get some seeds. Not too much, like I don't need a ton. I'll just put a few more out and then a good chunk of wheat, though. Just so that we can start breeding again, because we haven't bred animals in a little while and it's definitely useful to do, so let's get started with that. All right, chickens, there you go. Enjoy that. Oh, we got a few chickens going on here. I'll give you some even though you can't use it. And then we also get some eggs. Oh, look at these baby chickens. Here, let's pop those out. Oh, and we get one out of there too. So there we go, that was a huge boost in our chicken. I think we just doubled the amount of chickens we had. Is there only one sheep in here? Now there's two. Well, as long as we have two, we can do something. So, all right guys, give you two that. Have some fun with that. And look at that, we'll have a baby. Oh, oh just, yeah, he been his, hey, hey, hey. Hey, you stop it. Hey, you leave my livestock alone, buddy. I don't know what you're even doing around here. Um, hmm. That makes me nervous, but luckily he can't get in here. Okay, I'm gonna sneak in. Hey, no, cow, don't ruin this for the both of you. All right, here you go, here you go. Maybe I'll tame that dog so he can calm down. Maybe that'll be helpful. Oh, look at these baby cows. Hey, hey, you leave it be. I, I, hey, 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 stop. See what you did? I don't even know who you are, fine. I wanna get some, oh, I have 40 bones, cool. There is no way I'm not taming you right now. Hey, no, hey, 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 hey buddy. Would you like some bones? Would you Would you like just a little bit? Come on, no, you're just determined. You're gonna sit there for the rest of your life because you're not getting in there. Unless you're, yeah, you're not gonna do it, buddy. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna push him away if I can. Jeez, it's not gonna work. I don't wanna have to kill him because I think that'll make other wolves mad at me too. Come on, just keep pushing him away. Don't you dare, don't you dare. I'm gonna keep pushing you until... <sighs> Are you just gonna be here forever angry? I don't know what to do about you, so I'm just gonna leave you be. You know, when you want you know, some free bones, I'll be giving them to you. But in the meantime, you're just gonna be there all pouty. So a notch apple is really interesting because what we need to do... Here, let's go ahead. A notch apple, we need an apple in the center and then we need, here, where is it? It would probably, I, I think it'd be, okay, not a golden apple. It's just called a golden apple here though, but I think that's a notch apple, because these are both good. I think this is a notch apple, because we need, you know, eight, yeah, eight different golden blocks. So how much is that? That is nine times eight is 72, right? Yep, 72. Zebra math, zebra math. So we got 17 there. We might actually be able to do that right here, right now. Oh, we definitely can. All right, let's go ahead and give that a shot. If we can get one achievement done today, that'd be awesome. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, and we definitely have an apple or two way on over here. And it's like, maybe we could use this, like that's a golden apple there, but that's not a notch apple, I don't think. And craft. <laughs> well, if we did that wrong, we are out of a lot of gold, but hey, delicious. There you go, and our health is fully restored. We get two golden hearts, isn't that cool, little puff? And overpowered, there you go. We do get something for it, which is really darn cool. <laughs> I like it, very awesome. Also, one thing we can do is, now we can dye leather. So I'm gonna give that a shot, whoa. Absorption, fire resistance, resistance, and regeneration. Yeah, I could have used that in a better situation, sure, but for right now, I'm just going to um get some leather out. I'm gonna get out. Just about everything. If I'm gonna be building up a cow farm again, it's A-OK. -okay. Um, I'm gonna, here, I'm just gonna put a crafting table right here just for the convenience of it. And then I'm gonna craft a few more pants. Now why I'm doing that is because apparently we can dye leather and that's a part of the achievement. I think there's four different colors you can dye leather. I have no idea how this works, so we're figuring this out together. There's definitely nothing I could find in the crafting table that led me to believe you can maybe craft it that way. I know you don't craft the leather itself, but you can walk up, maybe I can, that doesn't do anything either. Huh. Weird. I'm not really sure how you can dye the leather then. We'll have to figure this out at some point. If you guys know, feel free to let me know. But like here, if you go to the pants, like it would be here, but it's not. Obviously I'm holding the ingredients I need, but uh, there doesn't seem to be anywhere or anything else. Maybe if I, maybe if I used an anvil? Here, let's try that. That might be a really weird idea. Yeah, that didn't that didn't really work. 
<laughs> I think an anvil should be my last idea there. But once we figure that out, we can have another, you know, few more sets of pans. I did double check the achievement and it said um, a set of four. So I need to find another place to continue my pan collection. I guess right here. That's where it gets a little odd. Hmm, my, my house isn't geometric enough for it. I mean, I guess I could just one, two, three, four, and then have one in the corner, though. That's not fair to that one pair. Well, I mean, <laughs> that rhymed, but I could... Hmm. Here. I'll try to figure this out. Because we have a good amount of stuff right now in our inventory, and that's a little bit messy, but hey. Let me let me try breaking this stuff. I get my stuff back, so it's whatever. There you go. Look at these dogs. They're ruthless, but they do kill skeletons, which is pretty handy. All right, so does that give me my stands back? Yeah, it does. Okay, first I was like, really? All right, put those back here. Oh, no, excuse me, please. <laughs> okay, put that there. And then put this here. And then do that. Let's see. Put that there. Put that there. Get one of these. Put it there. That way it's like... Now it's... How did I mess this up? I was going on... Uh, yeah. <laughs> no, that should work. No, that should work, okay. I'm just getting it mixed up. All right, let's get rid of this for now, because I'm not gonna want that there by the end of this. All right, and then let's build three more. All right, I made more than I think I'll ever need, but now I definitely won't be running out. You know, it's nothing like having some bonus materials, but there you go, so we'll have the four different colors, and then we'll have the main set. All right, now we just need to figure out how the heck to do it. Hopefully we'll find out soon. What is this over here? That's lapis, okay. Hmm. All right, so that's about all we can do for right now, though. All right, so I figure I'll slip outside and try to destroy a few uh, enemies, see if we can't find at the ending little piece of this. Now, look at these little creepers. They have a little creeper me. There's three of them in there. They're like, okay, how are we gonna creep on this guy? Oh gosh, he's found us. <laughs> creep on him. All right, so I'm gonna see if I can't find, you know, oh, pff. whoa, okay, he dropped. I thought he dropped red wool there for a second. Hmm, it looks like we won't be able to, but I was gonna see if we can't just, you know, spend the rest of our night finding some other stuff in the terms of, what's it called? Uh, Endermen, but not quite. I mean, obviously we're gonna need to destroy more Endermen than ever, but our luck is not very high with finding them right now. Hmm. All right, well, we tried. We slipped out here as soon as we could. But yeah, it seems like we got a lot of work cut out for us when it comes to achievements and all that kind of stuff. Uh, it's, it's sort of, you know, right now I just sort of have to put a lot of thought into how I want to organize things, what we want to go for first. Like, definitely whenever I have a chance to attack Endermen, I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. Hello, cow. Right now I'm just trying to use this very nice vantage point to find some Endermen. I don't want to go too far, but obviously if I'm on my railroad, I'll always be able to find my way back, and we're not too far off, so. Hmm, but I think I'll turn around now, because definitely I don't think I'm gonna be finding any Endermen too easily here in broad daylight. Not that they burn up, but just because... Usually you just can't. <laughs> All right then, let's keep going back. But I do have to say, from standing up here, it's very awesome to see how our houses sort of came together recently. It's just like, you know, there's a lot of recent additions. Like, this is new. I mean, I guess there isn't too many. But still, it's just like, I mean, it's just so cool to see what we've built. I know we gotta finish some things. Like, I feel like maybe these next few episodes we will take a break and sort of finish, you know, work on the, you know, more aesthetic side of things, which is the part where I'm really bad at Minecraft. Maybe make things look a little more good on the eyes in some way, shape, or form, who knows? Maybe make a basement extension to the house, that'd be cool, who knows? Maybe make more to this walkway, though. Make it so it goes over here, so that maybe we can see, you know, a giraffe over here, check out our iron golem friend from time to time, who's had this pig pal in there for the longest time now. I just, I just think that's so cute. We also do have some wheat left over, so I'm gonna use that to my advantage and give you two some wheat. And that's all I have on me right now, guys. Here, I'll be back, I'll be back. Here, let me, ooh, ooh, there you go. So luckily we can already uh, do more stuff with these guys. So you bet I'm gonna go ahead and get more wheat and try to take care of that too. But yeah, just sort of chiseling away at these new achievements and you know, getting to work on everything else as well. We'll need to pick up more wheat soon. Obviously we have a bunch ready to pick. So if we're, you know, getting back on the grind of things, it's cool. Cause you know, I feel like these last, you know, few episodes or so, we definitely haven't been grinding. We've been adventuring. So it's cool to get that mix. Because obviously I've been on the grind before. Because if, I mean I have a, you know, a, you know, a big mine shaft over here that goes all the way down the bedrock. For those of you who haven't seen it, it's all the way over here. And like, look at this. And this is where I'm gonna do the slime block thing. Once I have enough for a slime block, I'm just gonna put it down there, fall on it, and hopefully just bounce right back up. <laughs> Not sure how that's gonna work, but hopefully it works out well. I'll put it next to the ladder, sort of make it foolproof as much as I can. Well, okay, let's um. 
continue on over here. The wolf seems to have left, which is good. I'm gonna go over here and also try to uh, get these guys to be as happy as I can make them, because even the baby sheeps have all grown up already. Jeez, they grow fast. Oh man, getting all emotional. You guys grew up right before my eyes. All right. <laughs> but yeah, that's just about it, I think, for right now. I think we're gonna chill out with that. Maybe I'll just do some lasting things, which will probably be getting more uh, wheat here. But yeah, I just wanna say thank you guys so much for your support on the comeback of this series. It has been awesome. It's been so much fun being back and doing things other than you know trying to get a saddle. It's been sort of rejuvenating my interest for this series. So that's been awesome. It's been a lot of fun. And I just wanna thank you guys for your support on the series and just about everything else in the channel has been doing really darn awesome. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I almost have a full stack of wheat now. I wanna place this stuff back. Haven't done that in the longest time. It has to be like at least 15 episodes, if not more, since we last did that. But yeah, it's just, uh, this episode didn't have a lot of planning to it because I didn't realize we were gonna have new achievements and all that kind of stuff. So we have our work cut out for us for the next few episodes when it comes to planning things uh, and getting things ready for these achievements and getting our currently, you know, tough achievements done. So a lot of work out of us, but for now, I think it'll be good. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's episode of Minecraft PlayStation 4 Edition. If you did, make sure to give this video a like, share it with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.